When somebody comes with a straight knight attack, just the uh, first thing you want to do is to move to the outside when he's coming. Using this hand from the outside to push the hand. The dark side is out. This hand is grabbing the wrist. One more time. Here I am. With my legs, I'm jumping to the side. Jumping outside is right. Jumping inside is not good because from here he can slash, he can also punch. From here, he cannot do it. So I have to jump outside. 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 Outside and grab. Hitting the groin, pulling the elbow toward me to 90 degree. Lift the hand up and put it on his hand. When I put my hand on his hand, I have to create a pressure at a very close point of the knuckles. Here is right, here is wrong. I have to create a long leverage. So the pressure is here. Here I'm lifting my hand up, and as I push down, I'm turning it to the side. The knife is down and I have a control. If he try to punch, try to punch. <laughs> I press down. Try to punch. Full control. One more time, just a few more things. Grabbing the wrist has to be on the narrow side, as close as possible to where he's holding the knife. Here is right, here is wrong. If I'm holding here, I can pull the hand out. If I'm holding here, it's much harder for him. This hand that's pushing, have to be with the dark side out. This is right, this is wrong. Because if I do it this way, I can bring the knife to me. If I do it this way, the knife is going away from me. From here, as more I raise the hand up, more power I have to go, go and go to the groin. I'm taking this leg behind him, and as I do that, this is going to the groin. In reality, it's going to be right here, Right now, it's here. Sometime I can go from here to here. Here is better. Pulling the hand to me to 90 degree, creating the pressure, turning to the side as we learn. The knife, lift it up. If you lift it up, you cannot actually punch your mouth. 